Okay, okay. Copper drill is not a bad idea. I was kind of hoping one of these has it at like a car in the garage. Or garage, if you're in the recon. The garage. You know. Yeah, that was you. Yeah. yeah. No, it's me, yeah. You just left the front door open, but okay. <laughs> I found fertilizer, yeah, so if they start hoarding in, I'll create a C4. Fair enough. And what's, what's the worst thing that can happen? Close quarters, plastic explosive. Nothing. Uh, exactly. Uh, <laughs> I'm glad that you agree. How honest do you want me to be with you? <laughs> Is it going to be as honest as the C4 that I'm holding? Because <laughs> it's pretty honest. <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> it's like maybe not as honest as the C4. I see you in the garden. <laughs> You're welcome. Ooh, the middle house has a little child's play thing. It has a barbecue as well. Oh yeah, I was wondering if you could cook on the barbecue. Like if you had like matches or bowls or something. Uh, by the looks of it, you could potentially... Or if it's, uh, if it's electric, if you need like a generator and fuel. Ooh, it says fuel, 20 hours unlit. So it's technically got propane. Ah, oh, we refill it with propane tanks, so yeah, we, we technically we would use it. And yeah, can you use can it. just fuel it. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, you can also disassemble the uh, garden furniture as well. I'm assuming would help with your carpentry, but... Uh, yeah, I was just I'd rather stay indoors just in case the uh, the little dudes decide to sneak up on me. I can give you coverage. It's all good. I'm doing, I'm doing okay indoors at the moment. Fair. I'm just going into the houses from the back garden. Fair enough. If you want to come through this house. There's like some planks and nails on the floor. I don't know if you have enough room to pick them up. No idea, but is that you banging? Yeah. yeah. No. I'm hammering down a chair. If it's banging on the door, then no. No, <laughs> okay. That's not concerning. <laughs> Empty. Empty. Just eat this bucket. Oh, you fucking little good jump scare! God damn it! I knew it was yeah. somewhere. I couldn't tell where. I couldn't see the door shaking, and my brain yeah. just went, "My luck, this door, first choice." <laughs> <laughs> it was. It was this door, first choice. And she was in her bra and underwear. Yeah. Probably got, the, probably got the number one or the one pound box out of deal or no deal. <laughs> Figure it. You know. Oh, that's not you banging on the door, is it? Uh, no. Okay. Where is this bitch? Ooh, ah, bourbon. I can create a Molotov. Yeah, those are really good for dealing with hordes. You're a horde, aren't you? I can't say that I am. Uh, so you'd be objectively against this Molotov. Mm -hmm. So you would be objectively against me using this Molotov incorrectly? Yes. And do not throw it at houses because the yeah. fire spread is probably on and will get cooked. <laughs> Time to get cooked. I don't, I don't really feel like dying because of a fucking Molotov. <laughs> yeah. I'm just like bleach on the floor. Wait, hold up. Is Ooh, that bleach? I just found bleach. Do you want some? Yes. Yes, yes I do. <laughs> okay. I'm well, we're concerned to give it to you now. <laughs> Man's after I'm not, not going to kill myself. 
I already tried that, that with a painkiller, so it didn't work. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> I'm concerned. Speaking of painkillers. <laughs> Come on. Drug addict. <laughs> Come over to, to, to the pharmacy where nothing suspicious is out of the ordinary. <laughs> I swear to God, that pharmacy was looted before I got to it. <laughs> no, this isn't says, my lease agreement. He says while licking his teeth and rubbing his nose. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I swear to God. It was already looted, bro. <laughs> this, is, this isn't anything, officer. It's just sawdust. <laughs> It just well, smells see, yeah, I, work in, I work in construction, right? Yeah. And uh, like we get we get like a, a lot of chalk and shit just on our clothes. That's all it is. <laughs> Promise. No, no, no. Don't don't sniff it. Don't sniff it. No. <laughs> don't sniff it, yo. <laughs> Which house are you now in? Not a bad one. Tearing up every fucking cupboard and piece of furniture I can find. There's a lot of planks in here if you want to come collect them, because we need planks for building right? Mm -hmm. There's a bunch of nails and stuff on the floor too. I'll pick some up when I come back to the house, but if you want to come transport it while I'm still doing this, feel free. Yeah. How much of it will be able to pick it? You could bring the car over to make it a little bit easier. Uh. Yeah, my crap is literally full. Uh, yeah. Me drop that. And I literally just picked up every like key ring that like any of my dead corpses had. Mm. I just went, ah, yes, that's useful. To remember me by. There? Yeah, I'm downstairs. Okay, I think that's what that noise is then. I mean, I can, I know. I can let off around if it makes you feel better. Makes you feel more nah, secure. Yeah. No, 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 it does not. <laughs> <laughs> Make a Molotov, there we go. Uh, how do you... Oh, right, because my baseball bat's... Uh, yeah, okay, too big for the belt. That makes sense. Yeah, yeah, if you come into the kitchen, there's a whole bunch of planks and stuff in there. Okay. Nice. There's also a bunch of canned food and stuff. Yeah. Still carting around too many damn books. Yeah. Yeah, um, I think if you get nails, I can actually build storage crates. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, yeah, yeah, I need plank nails and level 3 carpentry, which I'm more than halfway there. No. I'm 213 out of 300 right now. So I can build up some storage crates if you pick up all of these resources and take them back. Yeah. And then we can actually store some crap instead of just throwing it in random shelves. Good. Also, if you find dish towels, they're probably the best way for us to dry off. So if it was in the rain, apparently you use a dish towel or a towel in general to basically just get dry, which, you know, it makes sense. Yeah. Why am I anxious? Uh, I can give you a beta blocker. No, that's right. I got some sinks. I'm good. Man, just do drugs. Just do drugs. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, why am I still carrying around like two stinking scopes? <laughs> like a gun. Place one. Uh, place it on the floor there. Yeah, I will pick up some of these resources and I come back over. Oh, my key lime pie is rotten. Would you like some key lime pie? It fills your hunger by 13. It gives you a little bit of boredom, though. You know what? I'm gonna pass on the pie. It's only, like, key lime pie, like, slice, so it's not, like, overly filling. Right. So if you're watching your figure, it'll, like, be wonders for you. 
I'm not watching my figure. Oh, well then you don't have anything to worry because this is high in like calories, like so you're all good. <laughs> it's even got a gonna, sprinkle of penicillin in it. I'm gonna pass on the pie. <laughs> <laughs> you never know when that penicillin pie will come in handy. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, I suppose this is why I'm told I'm not allowed to cook for people. Mm. So, would you like some key lime pie? Why is it just nothing but green and have some fur? Why are you asking oh. questions? Should you be asking these kind of questions? Or should you be eating the suspicious key lime pie? Uh, so, for metal working, you need a propane torch and welder's mask to be able to, to dismantle stuff. Okay, so we need the welder's thing, but there is that propane tank in the second gun. Oh, that's cool. So yeah, we just need the um, the welder's mask then. I'm not sure where you find one of those. Maybe some sort of factory? Hmm. I don't really imagine so. Oh, maybe, maybe an auto shop. Ooh, that's not a bad idea. Those would be my guesses, anyway. Hmm, not a bad idea, though. Definitely yeah. think it's worth doing. I, I can't remember if my character is a smoker or not, but I know I kept picking up... Oh, wait, no, my character isn't a smoker. It is now. <laughs> because you... Oh, yeah, you spawned in too quickly, and it's... Take your perks, did you? No, I was trying to like spawn in and get back to you like super quick, so I just literally went with like the base fire officer nonsense and just yeah. didn't do anything from that point. I mean, we could put you out of your misery, so you can. Uh, <laughs> I mean, you can get yourself some perks. <laughs> I'm willing to PvP with you. <laughs> hey, all I got is a hammer. <laughs> a hammer against shotgun. Now that is a battle for the ages. That is literally bringing a knife to a gunfight. Hey, I'm willing to use my Molotov against your hammer to see who comes out on top. It's a. Well, depends. Is my hammer throwable or not? Uh, can't throw it. We both start ten paces away from each other. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, it depends if I can outmaneuver it. I suppose. <laughs> well, if you can't, that stops being a me problem real quick. <laughs> that becomes a somebody else issue. GG, you know. 282 out of 300. <laughs> can't chill you. Can't eat. said can't chill you. I'm gonna deeper the root real quick. Oh, it uses four magnum rounds. I, oh, I don't know if I have any of those. I'll take the pistol off, just in case. You never know. Oh, it's I'm empty. I'll deposit the tools that I have so we don't lose them. Sweet. Just in case I die. Ooh, I found bandages. Bath towel. You said the first house up the road, though? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you go literally a straight line, it's literally the first one on the left. Oh, the first one on the left. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of stuff for you to deconstruct in here as well. I feel like we probably okay. should have gave it a little bit more thought on like the house that we're staying in. What? Because like our one has like a window missing. Yeah, yeah, but if we get the right metal working, we can put a metal frame on both sides of it. Mm, that's true. How did you fucking get it? Oh. Uh, right side of the house is open window. Yeah. There's a dash rancher key in here. 
Mm. I take it. I take it. That's the card here. Yeah, I was looking for that. Where you went? Uh, right in the, the living room. Yeah, this bookshelf. Ah, uh, okay. Odd place to keep a key. Yeah. Actually, not really. Mm. Yeah, but I remember, like, always lying as a kid, never leave your uh, keys by the front door because if somebody actually manages to, like, get in, you're making it easier for them. But in the same sense, it's also a good thing because it means that they're not going to, like, be mooching for your house while you're in bed to try and, like, find your shit. Yeah. There's a log wrench in there. I don't know how useful that is. Uh, it will definitely be useful at some point. Because if you think about it, we'll have to, I assume we'll have to replace tires at some point. As tires are an actual uh, thing. Yeah. Duct tape, electric yeah. wire, and torch, and another I'm hammer. Mm-hmm. Electric wire might be useful, I'll take it. Mm. Uh, I could have sworn this place had like an upstairs, but apparently not. No, it looks like a one story from outside. Oh my so god. Is it a base? They speed up a lot quicker now that this the speed limit. No! Waha! Get in. Run, run, other side, run. other side, other side, other side. Shit. Get us out of here. Oh my god, I just saw a bunch of zombies up there. That's not good. Uh, unless you want to go further away, we can go to a house uh, further in the dis- uh, Instead of going straight up, we can take a right. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if we should be sticking around here just in case they follow us back and start swarming the house. Mm. Did you get in the car? Yeah, yeah. I mean, oh, oh, okay. Stop. Yeah, but that's like... Yeah. Maybe uh, my thinking is, what if it's like distance? So if we get closer, we'd hear it. Yeah, maybe we can lead them away and like circle back. Mm. Oh no, it has stopped. Yeah. There's not that many here. I think that guy just fell over himself. I think that guy literally fell over underneath that bus uh, van. Okay, so he's not dead. Just wanna let me out and I'll finish him off. Okay. Oh wait, hold on, there's more showing up. Yeah, there's more, there's a lot more coming. There's only about three. No, there's more to the the left of us. Are you good there? My dude's not. Got his freaking weapon out for some stupid reason. No, okay, I don't know why, but I just got maintenance levels for smacking the shit out of a zombie. I mean, like... High maintenance, I suppose? I don't know. Like... There's a zombie inside of that house now as well. Um, I wonder if there's a key around on the floor... The zombie that got stuck is dead. Oh, there's a pen in here. Didn't you say you needed that for the map? Uh, I think so. I need to like draw on your little mini map. Hang on. Yeah. I'm gonna start collecting watches so we can upgrade our electronics as well. Nice. So if you see watches, tell me one of them just broke out of this house. Uh huh. That's not what you want to hear. No. There's one on the door, and one of them broke a window. Oh, I yeah, see. Yeah. It's still in the house. It's like climbing up. No, I don't know. There's one out here. Oh, there's two out here. Three out here. Daddy's coming. Hang on. Keep him still. He's dead. I got it. Don't shoot him. Behind you. I don't like this, they're all starting to show up. Yep. Yo, 
Yo, this this, this fight, fight baseball bat though, though it goes crazy. There's two, two empty gas cans in here. Some metal yeah. pipes, some metal sheets, some more metal sheets. Some wire. It's some useful stuff. <laughs> There's a leash in here. <laughs> <laughs> you know what to do, number three. Yeah. Put it on. There's a sleeping revolver in it. A sleeping revolver? The fuck? Sleeping pills and a revolver. I was about to say, a sleeping revolver? Isn't that literally what it's built for? Yeah. Uh, it takes 38. Oh, there's like camo gear in here. <laughs> Who turned to hide from the zombies? The boonie hat. Green camo hunting vest. Oh, wow. Um, offers me no bite defense compared to my actual like stuff that I've already got. Yeah. yeah. Alarm clock. I don't know how useful that would be. Um, I would imagine it would be useful to some degree. Ah, oh, there's some zombies outside. And try and kill him. I really don't want to get swarmed. No, uh, there's a few of them out here. <laughs> okay, I'm covering that. That's just, uh. I heard a weird noise, and I couldn't tell if it was in game or outside of the game, and my phone was going off at the same time, so my brain thought, hmm, <laughs> I might just see what that was. Alright, they're dead. Uh, uh, I was gonna say where you at. Yeah, we're good, we're good. Yo, Yo chill. chill! Fucking hell. Listen, a laceration is at least if you are. I mean, we could go check out where that blue building was. I can't remember what you said it was. Which one? Uh, the one to the left of us. It's a, a school, remember we looted it for a Oh, uh, yeah, we almost died, yeah. yeah. I, in fact, I'm pretty sure one of us actually died here, and I think it was me. Uh, yeah, a... I, I, got, I got fucking mauled, but somehow survived. Oh, uh, yeah, well, we both got, like, mugged out and done over here. Hmm. Oh. Okay, it's a shopping district. Did... Yo, uh, oh, I remember this place. There's a bunch of dead corpses right behind us from, I think, from when we... Uh, yeah, when we lagged out. Yeah, yeah. And uh, it was hard to see, like, literally anything. So I don't think we fully grasped the concept of how many we ran down. Yeah. Uh, my assault rifle might be on one of these corpses still, then. Fair enough. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> like, you hit like somebody at like thirty, and they have a like eight percent chance of survival. But like, I'm running over heads here. It's gonna let me out, and I can just finish him. All right, now you do, you buddy. Get out of the fucking biscuit packet, you little shit. <laughs> You're a rabbit, you dick. Everybody on the on the internet now knows you hate rabbits. That's fine. <laughs> Chester, I swear to get off my desk. Get down. Get the fuck down. How did, how did your rabbit get off my desk? <laughs> my bed is next to my desk. So he's, so he's on, on my bed, bed now. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off! Uh, ooh, do you want some maggots? Get down. You can eat the maggots. Stop staring at me. I'm good. Can they be used as bait though while you fish? Uh, I don't know. It just says uh, hunger minus one, unhappiness plus 20. Fair enough. 
Also, I found one of our corpses from when we spawned in because there's just a, a random baseball bat. Yeah. So I'm like, okay, that was one of us. There's another one of us. I don't know, I'm pretty sure I was just dropping broken baseball bats when I was from when I was using them. Mm. Just to end their corpses. Because why not? Yeah. <laughs> as well as that makes sense too. Okay, what's in this? Okay, I picked up a duffel bag, thinking it was one of theirs. Put it on, looked inside, chips. That's the shit. Um, it's crazy. Grocery stores. Ah. What a fresh food is now rotten or stay all day. I mean, it could be worse, like you could eat it by accident. Yeah. I mean, it's not a bad idea though, I'm just saying, like, penicillin. There's a lot of uncooked food in there, some of it's rotten, some of it's fresh. I think there's a lot of canned food in here though. Ooh, what, in the store? Yeah. Oh, it's a fucking. There's a sledgehammer in there. Ooh. What? Two gigabytes. Snow shovel? shovel? Snow shovels are a thing? Yeah, I think it gets winterier. There's lamps in here. Oh, I can't believe we went. We were going away from this place that long that all of the food is either stale or rotten. Like, yeah. this was such a great place. How are the potatoes still fresh? Yeah, I, I don't. Like, I don't know. Some of this There's is rotten. There's a whole rotten. bunch of candy, though. Like, a whole bunch. Some of it's it's a lot of it up. Yeah, some of it's rotten. Some of it's just stale. I'm like... Okay. Oh, Ooh. that's a squirrel. <laughs> Rock candy. Jube jubes, whatever the hell they are. And licorice. Like, I, don't, I think I already used to know what jube jubes actually were. I think they're an American thing. There's some soda and stuff over here if you can pick it up. Ooh, yes. There's more of your, your dish towels and more canned stuff. I am full. I need to go back to the car. <laughs> also, like Chelsea overheard me saying your name, and she was like, Who the hell's that? <laughs> I was like, well, it's a funny story. Ooh, a hand axe. Where, Where the fuck, fuck did you park the car? Uh, around the front. Oh, yeah, I got it. Kind of hoping like this giga place would have. Um... Oh my god, a pickaxe! What? Yep. So. Um... Like, I, I'm literally pick, uh, tire pump, leaf break, I'm literally picking up, like, next level stuff, right, right next to, like, food and stuff like that. I'm literally sat here thinking, okay, so, where is the ammo? Always, I'm, always ready for the guns. Yeah, yo, there's a freezer section, did you see that? Yeah, yeah, I did. I'm just literally looting all the candy, so instead of you having to read, you can just eat your happiness. <laughs> it's like real life. I wonder, if, I wonder if all of these fucking, like, industrial ovens you can sort of use, you know? To be fair, I like, think... Take, take with you and use. Uh, you can technically... There is a disassemble and put in your inventory function, I think. That could definitely be useful. Uh, it's a candy package over here. No idea what it does. <laughs> Snow shuffle sledgehammer. There's more fresh food back here. Is there any cleaning items though? Like any more bleach? Man needs a drink. For real. <laughs> Jeez. Gum, candy canes, bro. There's so much canned food back here. Yep. 
It's one that we'll have to uh, come back here at some point. Like, Ooh, a Rubik's Cube. <clears throat> I have so much canned food on me, and I put. Oh, uh, there's a uh, upstairs. You wanna come with? I don't know who's upstairs. Why are you shouting? Uh, just in case there was any in the. Upstairs bathrooms or upstairs rooms, uh, yeah. but it didn't entice anything. Anything up there? Uh, I don't know at the moment. I'm still kind of clearing room to room. Man <laughs> just like, swings open doors and goes, "Yes, time to die." I'm clearing it. <laughs> More Mormon, yes. Oh, and, uh, like, uh, radios and stuff. I hear noises, is that you? Maybe. Depends, depends on noise. Should we get out of here? Should we go back to base? I need to... What the yeah. fuck? Yeah, let's go back to base. <laughs> <laughs> I need to deposit some... Uh, <laughs> I got so much canned food on me. Man needs to make a deposit. For real. You can grab the, the back entrance that's it's closer to the, to the car. car. What? Did you move the car? Huh? Did you move the car? No, I think you have the key. Like, what back entrance? Oh, I see. Jeez, it was easy for me to break a window. <laughs> take us home, bro. I just wanted to quickly check something. That. Um. Um. Get us out of here. <laughs> Don't you worry, I got you, bro. Get us out of here. Okay, yeah, no, this isn't the place I remember. I'm trying not to let the car go to 150. How is this have to get what? This car will do 150 miles an hour while I'm trying to avoid hitting any and everything. How? I don't know. You tell me. Do you want me to show you how it can do 150 round corners? No, no, I do not. What was that? I couldn't hear you over the 150. Although, I must admit, thankfully to good suspension, because we, like, hit a bump uh, of a corpse, and I watched the rear end kind of lift. Oh god. I forgot that's a thing. Alright, nice. <laughs> you do that, and I'll go check the engine. <laughs> ah, she a good old car. Oh my god, I can use an I can use the empty <laughs> bleach bottles as an empty water container. Mmm. Makes sense. Tastes like clean. I'm going to put a bucket of water in the fridge. So if you ever need to drink it, you know where it's at. Yeah. 
Oh yeah, I need to fill up my bottle of water actually. It's like, oh, I need to drink. I'm thirsty. Here, have a bucket. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, thanks. Yeah, welcome, buddy. You got me a bucket. Oh shucks, I didn't get you anything. <laughs> it's like I got you a shotgun too. It's like, now what you get me for real, boy? Did you even check the back of this car? There's a tire pump and a, a tire in it. Yeah, I just left it in there. To be honest, I just kind of thought, hey, you know what? Uh, I'm prone to damaging things. I'll put the sledge. I'll put the sledgehammer. All the, all the, all the, all the things that get damaged are usually me. <laughs> I can put the tire on you. I don't know how well that would work. Well, I know how to use a lug wrench, so... Uh, yeah, look in this left crate. There's a whole bunch of canned food and, like, unperishable food in there. Noise. I'm going to put all the candy in there. Good idea. Because it doesn't seem like candy is perishable. Well, I mean, some technically are. I mean, all of it is technically, right? Mm. Come from the dust, we'll die to the dust. Asbestos. Funny enough, I actually know somebody who actually, um, well, I, I used to. Uh, I used to have, when I used to obviously deal with metering issues, uh, sometimes you get like, you, there's still meters out there that have asbestos around them. And oh, yeah. like, no engineer will go out and touch them. And you have to, I used to know somebody specifically in the asbestos team to get everything booked in. Um, yeah. Because obviously they need specialist equipment to rem to deal with the meter. I but I think it's only if the asbestos is in a specific area. Um, but to be honest, it's it's asbestos. I wouldn't want to touch that, even if I know I didn't have to touch that. Very valid point. I mean, it's dangerous. Mm. It's like um, people always say, like old houses are like the best sort of houses to buy or rent and in in a sense they technically are depending on how far back you go yeah there's a, there's a limit yeah like you, you give me one of those thatch roofs houses i know it's probably a decent house it's probably cozy but like the maintenance to keep a very old house like that because um i think with the thatch roofs you actually need a specialist to actually mend or maintain those roofs. That makes sense. Which, don't get me wrong, I thought was kind of like odd because you don't really see people maintaining roofs. Um, I suppose not. But I thought it was quite interesting as well because it's basically somebody's coming over to do something that not everybody knows how to do necessarily. Yeah. yeah. For like very old and time kind of houses, because obviously you wouldn't want to change that, and there's probably something that would also get in the way of taking that out. But um, it's like the house the uh, I'm in. It's not old, old, but you can tell it's been there for a while, and it is a nice house. But obviously, depending on how far back you go, the insulation's not going to be as great, so you'd have to like do renovations. Um. Yeah. But depending on how far back you go, I, you also kind of want to check it for asbestos and like the installations because like I'd rather not have it in the house, even if I know I'm never going into the attic. Like that's that's still like another thing. Kind yeah, of situation. I mean, it's always, yeah. always best to be safe. Hmm. Always best, best to be safe, safe than sorry. sorry. That is very true. And I don't want to block this window off because I want to try and fix it, but. Mm. Uh, 
Well, I'm pretty sure... Oh, I can build rain collectors, rain collector barrels. Ooh, go you. I need... I, oh, I need one more carpentry level, and I need... Uh, garbage bags. Yeah. Okay. I can also build compost, though. Bookcases, shelves, double shelves, beds, wooden signs. Okay. Interesting. Nothing, nothing from like bars to windows, though. Maybe it's not a yet kind of thing. Maybe you need to level well, like, up more. Yeah, I haven't got the right level for it. Very possibly. Oh my god, I put a lamp in the middle of the room and it actually works, it's not plugged into anything. <laughs> like, now that... Runs on, runs on batteries. I was thinking it was Bluetooth. <laughs> yeah. It connects Maybe. to the grid. Uh, let me see... If I can now mark and map... Uh, oh my god, I can. I can actually mark the map now. So I, I don't know if it shows up on yours, but I've got a house symbol where we're currently stood. Uh, um, no, there's nothing there for me. Uh, okay. I've uh, put a food symbol where that shop is. Actually, no, that's the small. The shop is over there, god damn it. Wait, is it that one? Yeah, I think that one. Uh, I don't think there is a... Is there a book icon here? Uh, da, 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 da. You know what okay, if I, I can... I can repair our wooden bats. Um, and the different materials you use give you a different chance of success. Um, so, if I use nails, it has a chance, 95% chance to repair 10% of the weapon. Yeah. If I use adhesive tape, it's the same. If I use two glue, it's the same. But duct tape and two wood glue has, oh no, sorry, duct tape has a 20% chance and 95%. And the potential repair is 55% for wood glue. Uh, and it's a hundred percent chance of success. Oh, okay. Interesting. That is quite interesting indeed. And so now I build more wood crates. <laughs> Deposit the pickaxe. Not too sure where we're mining, but. Uh, apparently we is could be really useful for um what's it called mm. uh just a weapon yeah I suppose that's a good point Progress has been made. Yes. Uh, high end camera. I uh, can't do anything with the camera. That's a shame. Well, I'm going to put the high end camera in the fireplace then. Uh, I wonder if you put an explosive in the fireplace. I wonder if it would ignite him. You know? I would not find out, to be honest with it. You sure? Like, it's not a bad idea, like, we are scientists. I mean, I don't, I don't really want to die. You really think you, I would let you die? Yes. Wow, I can't believe you'd agree. <laughs> I've only let you die, what, like once? And that was by pure mistake. The rest of those times, that, like, it wasn't a me issue. And, right. like, you hold no evidence either. There's, like, no proof. Right. Like, you know... 
we, we have, have so many nails that I can just keep repairing my my baseball bat. Yeah. Does yours need repairing or? Uh, I haven't been using it. I've I've literally just like dual equipped like meat cleavers. Okay. But I will start using the bat because to be fair, it's not it's a nice idea. Just make sure you, you equip it in both hands if you do use it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Better chance of success. Alright, what are we doing? Uh, you? Say less. <laughs> oh, well, there is a sofa. Right here, number three. Uh, have we got have we got electrical books? Uh, I believe so. Uh, if not, check the one of the bookshelves right behind us. Oh yeah. yeah, we definitely we definitely do. We have electrician one, three, and four. We don't have. We have a magazine for volume two. Oh, okay. I'm gonna read. I'm gonna read this electronics book then. I'm going to try and dismantle a whole bunch of watches. What's this? Number of pages, 220. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we might, we might be here for a while. And actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take this book upstairs because I don't want to get... <laughs> some I just jump in the window next to me. What are you afraid I'm, of? I'm gonna go up into my little bedroom. Me? Actually, you know, fuck we'll the bedroom. We're going into the closet. Oh, okay. That's where I like it. So I can come out of the closet. <laughs> well, well, well. Look at what we have here. There's a pretty thing like you know in a place like these. Three things. Oh. <laughs> All right then, you say. Well, then don't mind if I interrupt. <laughs> <Bruh>. <laughs> What's this? I see a bookmark. Not anymore. Remember your page? Didn't think so. Oh, I'd go live with someone that did that. It's like carrying your book around and someone's just like, oh, what a nice bookmark. What a shame. Mm. To be fair, I've actually been reading up on Warhammer lore stories, to be honest. Like, the actual canon, like, kind of stuff. It's quite interesting. Warhammer? Yeah. Nice. I haven't, I've never really interacted with Warhammer, but um, cause there's, there's stores, stores, aren't there, like where they sell the sort of yeah, yeah, figurines yeah. and stuff. Yeah, yeah I think I walked past one the other day actually, I was looking in the window, but I've never really been, I've never really got into it, to be fair. Uh, okay, that's alright, I'll get you into it. <laughs> yeah, I don't doubt I don't doubt it. <laughs> oh, do, you know, do you know what I started reading the other day? Ooh, what? I started reading, I don't know if you're a, like, sort of a DC or Marvel fan, but yeah. I was reading the Dark Knight's Metal for the first time. Hmm. And, oh my god, it's fucking sick. I've only read two so far. Yeah. I've read the Dark Knight's uh, Rising, I think it's called, and the Dark Knight's uh, Re Rebels, or something like that. Um, I can't remember... I can't remember what it's called. Shit. Uh, I can probably find it. Hold on. Is your character making noise? Only you turning pages. Okay, well, that wasn't turning pages kind of noises, so that's <laughs> not concerning.
I can hear turning pages noises, and then I heard like it sounded like somebody was messing with someone, like clunking or something like that. Yeah. yeah. I don't see anybody out here. Hmm, maybe it was just like a zombie next door or something like that. But um, yeah. Anyway, I was reading the the Dark Knight Metal for the for the first time. I, I've read quite a few different like comics in my time, but I've never read it before. Oh yeah. And I gotta say, I'm absolutely in love with it. It's it's amazing. Yeah, I do. Uh, I really do actually like Batman. To be honest, I really like the Dark Knight trilogy. Um, yeah. It's a shame they didn't make a fourth one because it looked like the way in the third one's ending, like there was going to be a fourth one. But then that's when Christian Bale turned around and said he wasn't going to uh, do Batman anymore, I think. Yeah. Um, which was obviously um, unfortunate because I really liked uh, that version of Batman. Yeah, he played it well, to be fair. Mm. Probably my favourite out of all of the Batmans that I ever have been. Yeah, to be honest. Um, my favourite one out of the three, though, is the one with Heath Ledger in. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, Dark Knight's. I think that's just the Dark Knight. I think Dark Knight Rising is the one with Bane. Yeah. Because um, obviously Heath Ledger plays the Joker like exceptionally well. Like I've always said that there is no like Joker after him or or. Oh yeah, hundred percent. He he nailed that legit. shit. Legit, like other people are like, ah oh, no, but this Joker's brown. I'm like, eh, I wouldn't go that far. I, I will. I will admit the the newest. I can't pronounce his name for shit. But the the newest one in the independent Joker movie, he played it really, really, really well, really well. And the way he was portrayed was really well done. The story and the writing and everything, it was very well done. Um, <laughs> but I, I'm not looking forward to the Joker two because it's turning into a fucking musical. I like. I'm gonna watch it. I'm gonna try not to judge before I watch it, but I just I've got a feeling that it's gonna be ruined. Uh yeah, I didn't even know that was a thing. Uh, yeah, cause, yeah, Lady Gaga is gonna be in it as the as Harley Quinn. Interesting. Who is like one of my favorite characters of all time, and I'm just really worried that she's gonna fuck her up. I hate it. I hated Margot Robbie for fucking her up. Yeah. And I'm afraid that Lady Gaga is going to do it even worse. <laughs> she starts singing Poker Face or like attacking yeah. like Batman. Literally. Yeah. God, like, I'm something. really worried about it. But uh, yeah, no, the, the original Dark, uh, Dark Knight trilogy, that was, that was peak cinema, let's be honest. Mm. Yeah, it's like during the, the uh, everybody else who plays other jokers, they're not necessarily bad, but I just think that Heath Ledger's just literally made it perfect. The only, yeah, the only other perfect casting for Batman and Joker, Kevin Conroy and Mark Hamill in the uh, Batman games, the Batman Arkham games. Ah, uh, yeah. Their voice acting in those games is just fucking phenomenal. Yeah, I think, um, is it Kevin Conroy, did you say? Yeah, yeah Kevin Conroy. Yeah, yeah he, he passed away, unfortunately. Yeah, I know. His last, uh, his last voiceover was for the Suicide Squad to go to Justice League. So sad. Damn. Yeah, like, he was, like, a great, uh, Batman he was amazing. Uh, he was amazing. I think he was Batman in a lot of the animated things as well. Yeah, I think I think so. 